What's going on everybody? Today, I'm gonna to discuss with you why I'm switching to DaVinci Resolve. I've only been doing YouTube for just over two years. A year on my original channel, which was movie reviews, and just over a year on this channel. But as far back as Windows XP days, my editing software of choice had always been Sony Vegas, or more recently, Magix Vegas. Every video that I've done, including my former band's music videos, the three full-length movies I've done, and everything in between, all of it had been edited with Vegas. I downloaded DaVinci probably two years ago, never really messed with it too much, at least not at first. Just kind of looking at the interface had me puzzled because I was so used to Vegas that a change in software, especially software that had no similarities to anything I was used to, was pretty intimidating. Around six months ago though, I started messing around with DaVinci, mostly playing around with the color grading features as well as kind of running my GoPro footage through it to render a file that Vegas would actually run. Now, Vegas has this issue of crashing with certain file types, or even file types that are just basic file types. Just something with the software, I'm not sure. And I was always fighting to be able to edit my footage with, you know, without at least three crashes. This drove me to mess with DaVinci even more. And I started becoming, well, a little bit more comfortable and familiar with the software. I started watching a few videos on YouTube, seeing the amazing things that DaVinci could actually do. So. I made the decision to switch 100% all of my editing workflow to DaVinci. So all my content from this point forward will be a step in what I believe to be the right direction. Stepping out of my comfort zone and away from the software that I'd spent years using. So this video is me kind of saying later to Sony Vegas and hello to new beginnings. Now I hope that starting with the very next video, you're all able to tell a difference in the videos. Now, I don't expect overnight progress, as there's still a huge learning curve for me. And so much to learn with the software that I'm still gonna edit in the same style, at least for now. I am gonna play around with it a lot though and see what works for me. So some changes are coming, some subtle, some maybe not so subtle. But the purpose of this channel will remain the same, photography and video. But I feel that this channel just needs a bit more entertainment. So from now on, instead of editing out all the goofy shit JD, Rooster, and myself do, maybe leave some of that in for you to enjoy. I feel by doing that, you can all connect with us on a different level because photography and videography are not meant to be boring. And there's some fun things that happen behind the scenes that I think you'll all get a kick out of and enjoy as much as we do. Anyway, I'm gonna cut this video short and cut it off here. So stay tuned for some cool stuff coming up. So until next time, don't think, just create. See ya.